what is up everybody welcome back to my channel um living in the green my name is michael if you're new i have been getting a decent amount of new subscribers and i thank you very much you guys know y'all do not know how much i appreciate all the new subscribers i have it took me forever to get to 100 i'm at 146 now oh my god oh my god but um, I'm going to be sharing with you guys some of the different tricks that I use to make my dining table look, you know, how I got the look that I wanted without spending the money that I didn't have. Yeah, that's a good way of saying it. Um, and if you haven't seen that video yet, I'll put like a little card thingy up here somewhere so you can go see me when I style that. And I'm going to go ahead and get to these tricks. Um, I was going to, it's going to go into my whole home decor hacks thing, but I'm going to start, stop calling them hacks. I'm gonna call them tricks because I yeah the little tricks that I have that's all so trick number one y'all know those green place cards that I have placement cards placemats name cards I think they're called name cards um those green ones that are on all the plates <laughs> yeah those are name cards <laughs> I actually have one these that's the better side these things yeah they're not name cards <laughs> guess what they're index cards can you see that yep there are the lines right there. These are index cards that I folded in half and I spray painted them green. Yes, I will spray paint paper if I have to. It was my first time spray painting paper, but you know, it came out pretty well. Number two is going to be that, um, that cake holder, that coral colored cake holder. Would you believe me if I told you that thing used to be dark blue? I had no use for a dark, dark blue cake holder. Like, what was I going to use that for? So I spray painted it. Spray painted it with... Coral color, let me see if you can see that. Gloss Coral and um, Rust-Oleum American Accents Two Times Ultra Cover. I like the Two Times Ultra Color and have this on it because it just, the coverage is much better in my opinion. So this is the color that I use on that cake holder to make it fit into the design because I want it more of a spring look. And dark blue just ain't, don't say it, don't scream spring to me, it screams winter. Number three, these glasses. Okay, there are three of these on the table, but the fourth one, I broke it a long, long time ago. So I had another one that looked similar. See, they're not the same glass at all. I have one of these and three of these. So at like, you know, unless you're really looking really hard at the table, you really can't tell because they're both like really big glasses <laughs> and they're like really wide and everything. There's like a subtle difference like around the bottom. Cause I think the top is the same size. Almost. The top is almost the same size. It's really the bottom, the base of it, that's different. So trick number three, like if you ain't got all of the same glass, you find a glass that looks real similar and put them all together, won't nobody even know. And if somebody do know, they looking too hard. And last but not least, I don't actually have a prop for this one, but the runner. The runner is not a runner. <laughs> the runner is a curtain it's window treatment literally it's a window treatment that um i just i never put up um i think when i went to the store to get it they didn't have two and i was gonna go back and see if they had another one later on and they never had one so i never had anything to do with it it used to be on my fireplace like i ain't never used that window curtain as a window curtain and i was a runner and i like it as a runner it looks very flowy and so yeah so those are my tricks for decorating my dining table for the springtime. Hopefully, you know, <laughs> you can use some of them, especially, you know, to place cards. I mean, that's real simple. Don't be don't be scared to spray um spray paint paper, y'all. Got to do what you got to do when you ain't got the money that you want to go buy what you want to use. Oh, that was that was ooh, that was a sentence. <laughs> but um that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you can use some of these tricks that I've used and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right. Bye now. By the way, before you go, oh, subscribe if you haven't already hit the bell notification and um, give this video a big thumbs up if you haven't done so already. And I'm going to have a new project going on, a big one. I'm going to be turning my entire house into a showroom. Stay tuned.